as we have already launched the website it's the time to download this particular excel file from right here to achieve that we can take an attached browser because we already have the browser opened we can go to attach browser and drag it and let's point this to this particular flow okay I have I have pointed this to that particular screen as you can see the title is RPA challenge now what is the step that we have to take we have to click on this let's click on that I can use click activity you can uh, because I have recently used it it is available in the recent tab else you can directly click here recent uh, your, sorry click okay the click activity is available here I'm trying to spy this particular button download Excel okay I can rename it once download Excel okay so this will click on download Excel let's go to this page what happens if I click on download Excel it is showing us a pop-up where we have to click we can click on open or save or save as because we want the file to be saved in particular location I'm clicking on save as let's buy this also drag click indicate on screen save as let's rename this button also it's save as I'm saving it then if I just go to this page what happens if I click on save as it is showing me some folders where I can uh, let's navigate to our current process is RPA challenge and this let me go to data and this input okay I want to save this particular file right here every time okay in that case I can give some name to it okay what I can directly do is I can go to this folder I can go to input okay and what I will do is I will copy this particular location and I can directly pass it over here so I have to type something in the file name so let me spy this also as we remember to type something we have to use type into let me indicate this particular thing okay I have indicated type into what type into file name or you can say na path basically okay just I have used double quotations and this is the path here let's give the input file name as input dot excel sx okay that's done type into if there is something in the field already we can turn it to true so it will just empty it and then try entering some data it will activate if you want to click something before you type something you can click on this also default time it's 30 seconds we have got a selector right here that's fine okay everything we don't want any delay before or after so everything is left like that and I'm clicking on save okay let me go to this if I just okay fine so I'm leaving it behind and saving it okay so when we do that there's some pop-up coming out I don't want to see this so what I will do is I will just go to this okay whenever this particular open folder appears on the screen I want to close this to do that let me use a 
element exists what I will do is I will spy this open folder as you can see I have got a selector for that let me rename this okay if this appears let me save this output to some flag some variable okay flag I'm saving it then if this turns to be true okay in case it turns to be true I'm taking an if statement okay if this flag is true okay because this particular if else statement takes a boolean as an input as you can see a boolean so if this value is true from this particular flow what it will do is it will try to click on that particular cross mark which is a close button okay that is done what happens so this is closed the next step that we have to do is we have to start the challenge so that we can proceed further let me come back to this particular code and I'm trying to use click activity click on start let me rename this too renaming the activities is a good practice because someone who is trying to support after you are no longer in the organization or if you want to troubleshoot some process it will be an easier task for you too it actually becomes easy for someone to maintain your repository right now we are done I can use log messages to make it more readable. Launching the website is the first task that I'm doing. I'm copying it. Then here, downloading the input file which is nothing but an excel okay click starting the challenge once that is done I will try to close all the instances of RPA challenge website and then let's one start it once again I'm clicking on run file so as per our behavior or expectations it should launch the website and should download the Excel file into our folder this particular folder okay because we already have a file and this I'm deleting that let's run this once So it is trying to launch the RPA challenge website. So let's click on save as. This oh sorry. So what we haven't done is we haven't clicked on save. Okay, no issues on that sorry let's go to this particular once we type into we have to click an button for that I have taken click activity and click on save so sometimes it's possible to forget something right here okay no worries on that you can stop the bot right over there and you can start it again let me close all the instances of this okay let me launch it once again
so it is launching it the reason it is relaunching is because last time we have given the time to it as 10 seconds right so that is the reason if we just can increase that that should be fine okay it has done the work as you can see it was able to download an input file this is the input file so we are done with this particular flow of launching this site and then downloading the excel